Forget about acquisition. Acquisition is tertiary. The primary goal of lifting. Use it quickly. Oh, fire! Be Let your mind be Holy God's fire! You know, I shared with you a story here, Koinonia, that one time a gentleman was entering into a city, and um, two gentlemen actually, and there was a farmer that they met just by the entrance of the city. And one walked to the farmer and said, Dear farmer, and he said, Yes, how can I help you? And he said, I hear that this city is full of all kinds of things violence you know moral decadence this city is full of thieves armed robbers on serious people and the farmer kept quiet and said you are right and the man passed a few hours later another gentleman coming into the city stopped by and said dear farmer i said yes can i help you and he said i hear that this city is full of visionary people the soil is very good it is able to produce and the farmer said yes all of it can be found in the same city in the same nigeria where it looks like economically we're going down in the same nigeria where it looks like we are losing our touch governmentally unfortunately in the same nigeria where it looks like there's darkness and everything in that same nigeria god is raising an army in that same nigeria there are souls that are being saved in that same nigeria are we together now it is up to you to change your perception by the influence of the spirit that when men say there is a casting down you don't join them to say there is a casting down the reason why they are down is because they said it for you you will say there is a lifting up it says let the redeemed of the lord say so koinonia learn to say so because when you say so it becomes so when you say so you create it so when you say so, you become a prophetic rainmaker over your destiny. Walking in abundance, moving in the speed of the Holy Ghost. I am favored. I believe it. That I am walking in abundance, moving in the speed of the Holy Ghost. Let me tell you the truth. I'm going to say something and I want you to pay attention. Years ago, even before God began to help this ministry and show us mercy, even in the area of finance and the rest, physically, everything was not there. We still had limitations here and there. But I can tell you by God, one thing I never stopped doing was to prophesy the, the version of Koinonia that will be financially stable to serve the Lord. I vowed a vow that I will never lie and manipulate God's people because of looking for offering to pay for tea and bread. And I found from scripture, it said, when I sent thee, lackest thou anything? I submit to you without any sense of pride. It does not matter what nation and what region God takes us. We have mastered the art of the supply of the spirit. Yes, sir. There's nothing the devil can do about it. It's not pride. It's the truth. Hallelujah. There is no time you will come here for koinonia and you will not experience the presence of God to lift you. Because you see, before you arrive here, the rainmakers were at work. Koinonia does not start on Sunday. The koinonia starts immediately after the last service. There are rainmakers. Are we together? The worship team is singing, praying, preparing to set the atmosphere. The prayer band is sending that, that cloud. Everybody's making his contribution. By the time we arrive, the cloud is ready. It's not our arrival that makes the cloud. That's too late. Whether the devil goes to Zaria or comes here or decides to go to you know, Kenya or go to America, the, the beautiful thing about cloud, eh, so many of you have flown across and you can see that sometimes you look at the, I mean, the size of the cloud covering, you, you can look at the region that the cloud is covering. That means you can be able to make such investment in the spirit that from here it will reach the US. From here it will reach Europe. 
in the name of Jesus Christ you can program that cloud over your house the moment defeat and failure comes the priest in the house has become a rainmaker already Satan not my children in the name of Jesus Satan not my finances Satan not my spiritual life Satan not my passion not my word study life you will not deflate my passion for God let the redeemed of the Lord say so remember the law is atmosphere the atmosphere gives the Holy Spirit room to rest upon you in partnership with the Word of God that has been invested within your spirit you begin to speak in Psalms in hymns in spiritual songs everything that is less than Psalms hymns spiritual songs please do not give it dominion over your speaking that a major part of your speaking should be a communication of psalms hymns and spiritual songs i've had the honor and the privilege of many times meeting the fathers of faith in this nation and i can tell you in my experience every one of them that i have met the moment you talk to them after 10 seconds they are saying something either it is well or praise god or hallelujah give god praise they are with you they have cultured themselves praise the lord praise the lord it is well while you are there and the devil is trying to tell you something that you should not believe praise god it is well hallelujah it is well ah daddy this it is well it is well praise god praise god no wonder they still remain praise god no wonder they still stand it is well no wonder the doors keep opening hallelujah it is well it is well the hymn writer says it is well and it is well with my soul listen we are wrapping up we're going to take two or three minutes to speak but I have given you a new position tonight consistent with scripture you are a prophetic rainmaker over your life this is how kings reign this is how kings reign this is how kings reign we reign through the excellency of our words for as long as I am alive the name of the Lord will be exalted through my life the name of the Lord will be exalted through this ministry for as long as I'm alive Nigeria will remain in God's prophetic program the cutting edge of God's program while we see the, the decline economically and otherwise for us so we begin to pray that Lord in the midst of this darkness you are brooding over every darkness you are causing light to shine from darkness the Holy Ghost is brooding over every darkness you are causing light to shine from the worst thing to lose is your sound. The worst thing to lose is your atmosphere. The worst thing to lose is your voice. You can lose money. Your voice will bring it back. You can lose relationships. Your speakings will bring it back. You can lose whatever at the scent of water. The voice of the Lord upon the waters is mighty. But if you lose your speaking, even the culmination of this church age, will happen with sound is the loud sound of the archangel that will wrap up this dispensation the earth started as far as we know through the sound of his word and God said anything will start continue and come to end in your life by saying and God blessed man and said and Abraham blessed Isaac and said and Isaac blessed Jacob and said make up your mind from today that the Word of God is going to be a, an intentional investment please look at me go and get Bible on mp3 go and get scriptures you can get it online It's free to download 
some of you are into tech businesses this is what you should do i just gave you a business idea instead of running around and stealing you can do something that is noble and honorable package the word of god some of you here you don't have to depend online you can go ahead and put together 100 healing scriptures 50 scriptures that help to redefine your identity in christ give your son as a gift son you are 10 years old you are two years old you are five years old let me teach you how kings reign kings do not reign by roaming around and waiting for things to happen you put it in your ears you program yourself your little baby without the ability to talk without the ability to understand but with the ability to transport words into his or her spirit in the name of jesus baby i decree and declare that you will serve the lord all the days of your life you are a proper child you are blessed i want you to do it husband lay your hands on your wife speak to her she's going out oh may god bless you don't just say honey god bless you and and then later you hear something you don't want to hear in the name of jesus i stand as your husband and i declare i declare that your morning is commanded go in peace return with joy you go forth in peace you are led forth with joy little children are going to school in the name of jesus i bless you go and do exploits you are a champion go and reign they will laugh you will think it's not getting into them by the time someone looks at them in school and say you are a fool they'll say daddy said i'm a champion yes sir yes sir you come to church for koinonia and several things are annoying you make up your mind the moment you are angry stop talking get an atmosphere put something in your ears in the name of jesus you immediately you are transported into a realm of possibilities and what would have made you angry is just neutralized because remember when seasons are about to open in your life i've taught you one of the things is the spirit of offense everything your husband annoys you your wife annoys you your staff annoy you nigeria annoys you africa annoys you journalists annoy you everything even god seems to annoy you but you must make up your mind the climate i remember atmosphere is a law I just lost this business in the name of Jesus. I refuse to be sad. I refuse to walk in despair. You set that atmosphere. Some of you, my dear people, all this worship that you are playing here, don't just do it for Koinonia alone. I've taught you this. One hour, imagine if they do something like that, wouldn't you patronize them? One hour of soaking worship, volume one. Are we together? I, I'm not saying this, this is not this is not some mark. I'm serious with what I'm saying. Program that atmosphere. Imagine that you just wake up from sleep and you are just stretching, and all you hear is Amen, 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 Hey, Amen, 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 Amen. for stretching and you move to the other side of the bed the dream continues in that dream you are scattering the gates of hell empowered by the strength of the word within you you get up with the keys like jesus got up from the keys as soon as you wake up from that dream who is this king of glory the lord strong and mighty the lord mighty battle One more time. Amen. Amen. 
Forget about acquisition. Acquisition is tertiary. The primary goal of lifting. Use it quickly. Oh, fire! Let your mind be holy. God's fire.